Hi to everyone, this is uh, Francesco Savastano, the author of the program that you are seeing now <coughs> in this moment, which is uh, called Focus Photo Editor. This is the version uh, 6.5.1, as you can see from the, from the top bar. Now we will learn how to do some simple tasks in this tutorial on how to use this software. Focus Photo Editor is uh, an image editor and uh, can be used to adjust, improve and uh, heavily retouching any kind of picture and digital photo. So this is uh, a picture that we, ha we have now loaded in the editor. Uh, we can uh, open any picture using the picture browser which uh, is a convenient way to show the pictures in your uh, computer folder and uh, you can select the one uh, that you like even m multiple selection now let's just take this picture uh, apply some uh, basic correction the first thing that you want to do with the picture is to adjust its basic appearance basic appearance so uh, a quick way way to do this is the quick fix wizard which is um, a, a combo a nice combo of different uh, corrections which are applied in the same time to the uh, to the picture now you can see when you open the quick fix wizard from the menu or from uh, the top toolbar that this uh, frame is open. Here you can see uh, the different sliders for uh, every kind of correction. You will see the auto stretch uh, slider, the gamma correction, the contrast, the saturation, color cast detection, fill light, backlight, shadow level and highlights level. These are all important uh, factors that affect the um, appearance of a picture. Now you can see in the original that the uh, uh, exposure of this picture is very flat, there is no cast and um, the colors also are not interesting, they are very flat and dull. So we will try to improve this and to start the correction you can press the suggest button which uh, gives a, a good start uh, for the correction. Then we can adjust uh, the parameters uh, by looking at the preview picture here in the bottom. So we can for example give it more light using the gamma correction, more contrast, more saturation, which is a way to improve the color, to make the color uh, to stand out more and we can open more the shadows with, with the fill light uh, correction tool and we can even take back a little the backlight which is uh, basically the, the uh, most um, high tones in the pictures then we can also uh, adjust the highlight level which is uh, another way to change the contrast of the high tones and the uh, contrast of the low tones. When we are happy with the result we can press the apply button. So here is the result uh, which has been applied to the picture. We can close this wizard now and we can go to another kind of improvement. You can see that there is enough uh, now detail in the picture, but we want a little bit more mm, tone contrast in the um, different areas of this picture, which was very flat initially. So we we will try now an interesting uh, command, which is the auto auto adaptive exposure. This will create we will divide. Uh, picture into different zone and will uh, amplify the brightness and contrast uh, analyzing the pictures uh, the picture and detecting where it needs more contrast more light. 
So let's uh, use the um, suggested values here and let's just press the OK button. So you can see that the contrast of the picture has been improved uh, but only locally, not in a uh, not in a general way, not acting on the whole picture, but just on different parts of the picture. So we are quite happy with this uh, result, and uh, we can, for example, also improve a little bit the level of detail by using the auto sharpen. Uh, command from the menu detail noise lens. So let's let's apply it, and you can see that uh, the details of the picture have been uh, brought out more. So this is uh, all for this first tutorial. I hope that you enjoyed it.